Hey folks, this is James, the unofficial mayor of Cowboy Country. We are at New Mexico State in Las Cruces, New Mexico, home of the Aggies. This is Aggie Memorial Stadium. And uh, let's uh, see what we got here. I see an open door over there. I, I don't know. Oh, this must be a student. All right. So. This is pretty cool. We got a student section. You can buy tickets. Okay, that side's built into a hill. There's not really much on the other side. I don't know if it'd be prudent for me to go in here. I guess I could peek. Uh, just hope I don't end up in jail. <laughs> Very quiet. The academic center. I guess they're in the whack. I'm going to keep looking around. I said they have another line over here for students. Ugh. Right. Uh, not on the field at any time. Uh -huh. Thinking that's their baseball over there. Tennis over there. That's cool. I'm going to walk around and get reset, see if there's anything up there. This gate is open. Huh. Let's go peek. At least I'll get you a better video of this stadium than I will. UTEP. You got, you know, on that side, you got some club and suite up the top. I like that. Look at that in the, in the end zone there. That's really cool. Okay. Not bad. Memorial Stadium. Not really a whole lot of. I see some chairbacks in the middle there, but not a lot. That would definitely help out some.
I want to catch that up here. I guess that's like their Hall of Fame or Ring of Honor. Okay, there we go. That's the outside on this side. There's not much there. So here's your football operations and. If I can get across the street. Okay, so interesting. So over here separate you got this says weight training center, so you got your gym and then you got your locker room. Uh, hard hat lunch pail. Okay. Ticket offices. This is actually open. This is cool. I didn't know this. I think on the other side of this building is their soccer. Um, it's one of these buildings I saw. It said that it was. Uh, All right, next. future home in New Mexico State. So they may be doing some construction here soon to build up their facilities. I love how they put the alma mater on the back of the scoreboard. That's pretty cool. I like that. Okay. Aggie up. Okay. I like their version of Pistol Pete. I don't like it better than ours, but I like their version of Pistol Pete. It's, it's pretty cool. QR code. Hope you get tickets. All right. You should get some shots from this side. Maggie Football Legends. That's cool. Uh, see, that's the kind of stuff, you know, that's a, you can honor the past. Oh, actually, I've already gotten a shot up there. We'll go down here. <sighs> this, is, this is a good view. See, this is one of the reasons I actually enjoy going to smaller stadiums is... If you noticed, UTEP was locked up tighter than a drum. Okay. I think that that might be like concessions. Yeah, in the corners, in the four corners, they've got concessions on the concourse. That's cool. It's kind of like Sam Houston State, where you're able to be in line, and you're you're wanting to get something to eat. Yep, concessions entrance. So this I like this. Although it's a little weird that you know you got Pistol Pete and Crimson. I'm not used to that. So you can be in line to get your food or get something to drink or whatever, and you can still be watching the game at the same time. So I do have to admit, I really like this end zone area. That's really, that's really cool. I do like the seats in the corners. Uh, I mean, it's just basic concrete. Of course, I would put the students there. Now, I don't know why they have nothing behind that over there. I put some seats there, put the band there, you know. But that's just me. 
Uh, this is pretty nice. Plenty of restrooms. That's always good. You know, when you have uh, 10, 15,000, you know, however many this holds, when you have a whole bunch of people. Okay. Let's see here. So they went to the Sun Bowl in 1935. Or Conference 1938, Sun Bowl 1959, Sun Bowl 1960, Missouri Valley. Conf I'm assuming when they say conference, I'm assuming they mean that they won the conference championship. So they won the Border Conference Championship in 1960, Missouri Valley in 1976, Missouri Valley in 1978. And they went to the Arizona Bowl in 2017. Okay. Uh, they're not shy about. Um, they got logos everywhere. They even got advertisements, you know. Uh, I guess this concourse is a pretty busy place. I'm assuming they have signs on the other side, too, for advertisement. I kind of have to use the restroom. I want to see if it's open. Thank you to New Mexico State for leaving your bathrooms open. <sighs> it take care of business. I said, I really like that end zone area. That's super cool. They need to do something with the other one. I would put like some seats in there, put your band there. Yeah. <sighs> I don't mind the signs, you know, the signage, you know, it's another way to bring in income for the athletic department. They're very proud of the fact that they won the Arizona Bowl. That's cool. Hey. Hall of Legends. Interesting. No alcohol beyond this point. <laughs> All right. So apparently they do re allow re-entry, but only through these gates. I wouldn't. You come in, you're in. Anyway, I do have to admit that scenery in the background is very, it's kind of like the Utah schools that I did last year. So, I'm thinking that Pan American Center, I think that's their basketball arena. At least it looks like an old school basketball arena. And so you got student housing over there. So. I'm going to go back up front. Not that I'm trying to do anything wrong. It's just I don't want to deal with the police. So I, I didn't do the front of the football operations building earlier. I just stuck my phone in my pocket real quick. But, you know, they do similar like any other school like this is 
when you, when you show up, you want, this is the kind of stuff you can see the jerseys on the wall. This is the kind of stuff you want to show uh, a potential recruit, you know. So, anyway, let me turn this around. So that's New Mexico State. It's uh, decent facilities. I'm going to try to cross the street here. We'll get finished up. But uh do like the fact how open it was. do like the fact they got logos everywhere. Um, I like the concessions in the bowl area. Uh, people can be in line and uh, be waiting to get their food and watch the game at the same time. I think that's pretty cool. So, decent facilities. Uh, so, um, if you are new to the channel, please hit like and subscribe. Um, I, I like their their version of Pistol Pete, but I think ours is just a little bit better. So, anyway, uh, I hope you have a great day, and as always, go Pokes. Uh, by the way, I'm headed to Albuquerque, and I'll be doing New Mexico later today. So, hope you have a good one.